Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm gonna be explaining to you guys how you can sell prints on your store on Squarespace. So let's get right into it. Now, if you're selling prints on fabric, such as t-shirts or anything else, or if you're doing prints on a canvas or any other material, paper, uh, completely depends on what you're doing. Uh, you can do so in a couple of different methods. First, you're gonna go into products and services and click on products. Then you're going to click add a product and then you're select going to select the type you can select physical or you can select custom merch most likely you're going to use custom merch for prints click on custom merch and you're going to add uh, a new product now you're going to have to connect uh, to printful on squarespace this is the only integration that works with custom uh, merch there might be other integrations but this is the one officially supported by squarespace squarespace as you can see you just need to click connect and create a new account on printful if you don't already have it and then as you can see you only need to pay for what you sell you don't need to hold inventory it is pretty much print on demand and it is shipped automatically to wherever your customers fill up you can also select products from the printful catalog such as hoodies uh, caps prints or home and living uh, prints are as you can see here so you don't need to add physical products but pretty much all you need to do is just click connect connect your accounts and set up all the merch that you want on printful uh, you can also browse the catalog completely to see exactly what services they offer uh, but yeah that is pretty much all you need to do now i'm not going to be showing you guys how you can set up printful since i do not have the resources to currently do so but it is pretty self-explanatory pretty easy to figure out and that is pretty much it you just need to connect the two and then use printful for everything and there is pretty much no more work to be done. Hope you guys enjoyed and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.